everybody. So glad you're with us. Joe Tessitore alongside Teddy Atlas, and we welcome you to London, England. We're at the Royal London Theater. Our main event should be a good one tonight. 12 rounds in the heavyweight division between these two great warriors. All right, so it's going to be Vladimir Klitschko trying to get some revenge for his brother against Lennox Lewis. Well, they're scheduled to go to full 12 here tonight. Round one now underway. Teddy, you think Lennox needs to actually maybe get after this guy he's fighting tonight who's going to try to stay on the outside? I don't think he wants to get after him because by being all anxious and going after him, he's going to walk into trap. He needs to control the center of the ring. Starts with the jab. Lewis has got a way of just getting away from that punch. <laughs> And a well-placed counter by Lewis. He ate that counter. Nice work to the midsection with the left. coming upon the halfway mark of this three-minute round. <laughs> Keeping his hands up, getting rid of his opponent's offense. around ringside and look at the judges i'm wondering what they're writing down that, that was, was a 18. tough round to score yeah it was and you know it's the it kind of best round opening where round one guy would be really smart to take a page out of the book of sugar ray leonard marvin Hagler, where leonard stole rounds at the end where he just clipped off 30 seconds and that's exactly what the judges remembered and another jab comes in by lewis A smart oh, and resourceful like uppercut by Klitschko. <laughs> Teddy, early on in the career of Lennox Lewis, a lot of the British fans actually did gravitate towards him because he was one of these nomadic kind of fighters. You know, Jamaican, lived in Britain, but won a gold for Canada. Yeah, but the most important part of that geography is his own. He had his own identity. He knew where he stood. He knew where his confidence came from. He knew what his style was. Oh, and they decide to trade there. <laughs> working his there way on go. the outside and working well, he just stunned his opponent. And his opponent got caught wide. Because he was standing in front, not doing nothing. If you're not going to work, get out of range. Don't let your opponent work. He went from almost being knocked out to being right back in it. Very well done by both men to fire off those right hands. Good block there by Klitschko. Back and forth exchange. A nice block by Klitschko. Ten clicks of the talk. All right, that was a much better round. Stunned. I'll tell you that. Um, 
your distance. Yeah, Stay I'll away stick from that it. on health as well. So here we are, a new round underway, and in that last round, he got tagged. He got hit pretty hard, Teddy. Yeah, he did. He got caught. Now, the first thing is, we all know he got caught, but why did he get caught? He has to be able to decipher that in his head. He has to be able to have the answer to that so it doesn't happen again. Oh, that's oh. gotta hurt. There you go, Blitz goes in Just as Teddy Atlas was saying, he needs the answer. Oh, look at that. He's hurt. But hey, I give him credit. He's smart enough to know what to do now. Yeah, the referee needs a crowbar to separate him. He was damaged moments ago, but now he's got his feet back underneath him. Teddy, many times with Lennox Lewis, you get a feeling of where things are headed. Oh! Flinch goes in a bad place right now. He was... There it is! Flinch goes down. Bothered him. He went down hard. Here we go. Two after the, the finishing blow. From a big shot now he's got to have some big guts to move along you're gonna find out exactly what he's made of very clever move there a little defense turns to offense the counter punch by Klitschko the knockdown and Teddy when a fighter comes back to the corner having just been floored typically how are they acting what are you seeing out of that just imagine you just walked into a room and somebody hit you from behind you drop you're afraid to go in that room again so put a light on in that room and explain to him why he got dropped he will not be afraid to go back in that room he gets rid of that it was intended for his head a little defense turns to offense by Klitschko. There's a lot of missing Klitschko going on from both sides here. now. After being knocked down in the last round, Teddy, what are some of the things you look for that will tell you he's on steady ground, that he looks fine? Well, the first thing I look for is the base, the foundation. I mean, you look at a house, you want to see, and you want to make sure that that basement is solid. There's cinder blocks there. You know, you don't want to see that upper floor waving a little when there's a wind. You're looking at his legs. You want to make sure that they're steady, they're firm. How much of what Lewis does well is the fact that he has a great identity of himself as a fighter? Well, that's all of it. Because, you know, we've talked about his body, we've talked about all those things, the physical power. You have to know how to use it and what way you're going to go about that. He has discovered that. Good defense upstairs to stay away from that offensive assault. Klitschko's not showing us that he understands just how effective he can be if he went downstairs against his opponent. Yeah, well, you know what you're saying, Joe? You're taking a peek and you're taking a swipe without meaning at his trainers. Because what he's telling you is he hasn't been taught too much some of the rudiments again. of boxing. As always. That when you hurt a guy, you should go downstairs to finish him. how that started right there but the bottom line is he's got to deal with it. again Lewis's corner men are gonna have to look him over after being cut in that last round oh well I don't know if he's hip to the idea of becoming a counter puncher but I get the sense you oh Klitsch goes stunned and he is hurt well we told you it could be this kind of fight and as advertised thus far Couldn't 
catch up though. Beautiful game plan there. Out from range and into the power. Does the win. And for yeah, the second good. time tonight, he goes down. Lovely. Stay down. He gets up after that punch, put him down on the canvas. Now he needs to get on that bicycle and stay away from this guy. Oh, that's good stuff. Fire it right back with one of his own. Good work by Klitschko. Lennox able to block that punch. Defensive guard there. Coming to the end of round number five, last ten seconds. is doing it just the way again. he wants to do it and that last round kind of sums up there. the whole Lovely. fight in complete control he's up on the scorecards heading towards another victory and he's up on my scorecard now he just has to be careful that he doesn't get careless he doesn't get reckless and a shooting right hand by Lewis well placed counter punch by Klitschko Glitch goes sticking to what we've always known of him, Teddy. The style hasn't changed, even though he was knocked down earlier. You know, a lot of trainers would say, hey, they pat him on the back. They say, there you go, kid. You know, stay with your identity. Just make sure that you correct a couple little things you need to correct. Able to dismiss it. out very well the counter punch landing by Klitschko great pace to this fight Teddy these guys are not coming out of fifth gear nobody's slowing down no they're fighting a six seven and eight gear wow just sit back and enjoy this one you can tell both guys are so determined to give everything they have here tonight so it's like the first time you heard Ray Charles sing God bless America you knew it was special you knew you hadn't heard it before I haven't seen anything like this before good job by drawing in his opponent and then landing the counter punch by Klitschko Some sharp offensive maestro work there by Lewis. A little defense turns to offense by Lewis. Lewis is in control here. You can just look at this fight for 10 seconds and you've seen everything you need to see because there hasn't been a moment where it hasn't been his fight. Yeah, you know, you talk about those sins. A lot of times people say there's seven virtues, there's seven sins out there. One of the sins that you hear about is greed. That's the only thing that could beat him right now, is if he gets greedy. Lewis is banged around really thought that was going for the head. <laughs> Well, he told us all week long, hey, I want to keep it on the outside. I don't care where he is. This fight's not going his way right now. No, it's not. And I don't care how long he is, how tall he is. But just look at his feet. When he throws punches, they're sliding forward. And that's why he's not keeping that advantage on the outside. Teddy Lennox Lewis, this is a fighter who we have a great sense of what his abilities are based on his amateur career because we saw plenty of him. 
Yeah, and his abilities really start with that size. He knows how to use that size. Targeted counter punch by Lewis. What a great job. He gave one right back in return. Nice work by Lewis. Oh, he's sending more than one at him now. The combo to the head. Consecutive shots. Well done by Lennox Lewis. Lewis is putting together punch stats tonight that go right in line with what his strategy is. Outside. Oh, Flinch goes Stumped stunned again. and he is hurt. is in complete control. Teddy, way ahead on the scorecards every which way, isn't it? Yeah, every which way, and especially the most important way, I think, is that the fight is in his kind of pace. It's a fast-paced fight. It's an outside fight. It's exactly what he wants, not only to be ahead, which we think he is, but to stay ahead. Good block by Klitschko. just not himself and he hasn't been for quite some time now i know he got rocked earlier in this fight you think that's got anything to do with it you know i think physically he's overcome it but mentally that's rocked. lingering on I put him he's down twice has not come back he's he's like there, but not as fun decked <laughs> oh, i like it <laughs> halfway through what is one of the best rounds you'll ever see just great action no it's unbelievable i mean if you love roller coasters you go to an amusement mm. park if you want to see left hooks, right hands, every direction, great chins, great endurance, great heart, you come to this fight. You stay right here. Oh, that's got to hurt. Lynch goes in. Wow. Lynch goes knocked down. Punching him when he's on his knees. I think that's a little bit naughty. Lennox Lewis 2-0 against the Klitschko brothers. It doesn't get better than that. I'm happy with that one. Lennox Lewis is your winner by knockout, Teddy. Well, we came in wondering whether or not his opponent had a good chin. We found out. For Teddy Atlas, I'm Joe Tessitore. We'll see you next time ringside. Two of the judges gave him a round. I'm not sure I'd agree. I think I like judge number three best. Anyway, thanks for watching.